All right, gang. This is another airplane I bought my son when he was a young kid. It was in the 90s, I believe. Mid 90s. This is an Air Hogs P40 Tomahawk. Now, I always liked the P40s when I was a kid. Uh, still do. They're one of my favorite planes. And I, I, I must attribute that to, the, I guess, the sharp mouth on them uh, and the design. They're, they're a good looking plane. When I saw this, and this is another purchase from Toys R Us, I don't recall what I paid for it. I thought it was pretty cool. And this was a Christmas gift to my son. And we actually flew this. And it flew very well. It just got to the point where my son wasn't listening. And he kept getting it stuck on roofs of buildings. And I'm, I'm, I just got to the point where enough was enough. <laughs> if I tell you not to fly it in that direction and you do it anyway, you're not going to fly it anymore. So it... He probably get, played with it for about a month, and it turned out that every time he would fly it, I'd have to drag a ladder and get up on a roof, especially at the community center in my little community, because we take it to the ball fields and fly it for the wide open spaces, and he would always somehow aim it toward the community center and get it stuck on a roof. And that got kind of annoying, so it got packed up and put away. Because one, I didn't want him to tear the plane up. Because he was always, it seemed like his goal was to hit something with it. And uh, two, it was just a lot of work on me. All right, but we're going to check out the box. Air Hog Air Pressure Engines Classics. This is real flying air pressure plane. Just pump it up. And then shows you a picture of the pump, which is a heavy duty pump for the plane. Uh, the engine it says it flies over 100 yards, and it did, it flew really well. And then it says authentic P40 Tomahawk. Alright, there's the end of the box. Pretty good looking angle of the plane. Alright, here's uh, another panel. And it shows you another plane, a Liberator, a Sandstormer. When, when I was a kid, these were called Air Jammers. Uh, and when they re-released them back in the 90s, I bought my son the Volkswagen. It's yellow, but it does not look like that. I think it might not be packed up. I'll have to see. There's the, uh, another plane called a Renegade. And warp stream looks like a rocket that you launch off of a pistol. That's pretty cool. And here's the back. You know, it says Air Hogs Classic again, but it, it tells you the plane can do bomber banks, dogfight dives, and that, that was one of the most popular things there to do as a dogfight dive and combat climb. And it gives you a, a flight log of features. All right, here's the plane with the pump in the background. Like I said, the pump's pretty heavy duty. And the plane is just styrofoam. No landing gears, not remote control. It's just pump it and toss it. And uh, like I said, he did a, a fairly good job. And for as many times as he got it stuck on roofs, uh, in trees, it's not tore up or anything. This wing has a stress here, but it's not that bad. Uh, the only thing that's missing is that there's two rubber bands to hold the wing section on. The one that wraps around the fuselage in the wing, it's missing. I have no idea what happened to it. There's only one of the bands and it's I've got it hooked back here and it just wraps around and hooks on these pins. Alright, here's the view from the other side. Like I said, it's, it's a good looking plane. Alright, here's the air chamber. It looks just a plastic bottle. 
in here sorry about that that's where you connect the air pump to to fill the chamber with air now my son did move on to remote control planes until he realized how expensive they was when I quit fixing them uh, I may post a video of his trainer plane uh, but this the big plane I bought him was a Cessna <laughs> And he destroyed it the first day he flew it. And I paid over two hundred something dollars for it, so he had to fix it. So after he paid every dime to fix it, he put it in a box and never flew it again and gave up flying. <laughs> he moved on to trucks. He had a ton of RC cars, but we started doing the rock crawling with the trucks. Now I have seven of those. But this is the Air Hog P40 Tomahawk. Pretty cool plane. Uh, if you collect the air hog stuff, you don't have this in your collection. I would recommend you hunt one down. Uh, I just it's the 15th today of September. I checked eBay and they did not have one of these on eBay. Uh, I looked on Google and I saw some pictures, but it was just a plane. Most of them didn't have the box, and but there was a few that did have the box. Uh, the box you saw the box. It's got great graphics on it. The team, uh, that's it for this P40 Airhog. Have a great day.